Worthen FC TV with Adam Hinchwood following on from the civil draw against Truro. How are you feeling after that one, Adam? Um, yes, yeah, like mixed emotions, I think. Um, a bit disappointed again with our first half display. Um, you go down a, a goal early, um, which looks like it could be offside. Um, and then, yeah, like full credit to the players, they show unbelievable character and fight. And you know, I think we really penned them in uh, second half um, with all your guys' voices behind the goal as well, cheering us on. And yeah, obviously, the, the two sending offs are, are, are big. Um, when you get four players booked first half and you barely made a tackle, um, then you're always going to be up against it, really. Um, so, yeah, I did say that at half time that they've got to be careful and you can't go and make lazy challenges. And I think there was a couple of lazy challenges that the lads have got sent off for. So, yeah, um, all in all, I think it's, it's good character. Um, but, yeah, just a bit disappointing not to get three points. Fulham like really grew into the game for the first half. We didn't quite weren't quite out of the races, but second half we felt like the team were a lot more energised, a little bit more advanced. What was different from half time? Don't know. We've got to find a way to to start games like that. Um, like at the end there, this player showing some character and wanting to win headers in our box and stuff. When you're down to nine men, um, you know where's that when you're eleven v eleven and, and start a game like that? And it's just where we are at the moment. Like a bit of a funny place with a few in the squad that. Um, you know, battling with fitness and battling with confidence and, and stuff like that and yeah, um, you know, it, I thought we showed a lot of character um, and a lot of fight, um, you know, and just disappointed we couldn't hang on towards the end there. The fight aside, what particularly impressed you today? Was there any players in particular that stood out? Um, no, that's the thing. I think there's more to come from a lot of players. Uh, I don't think there's too many players come away and thought they were excellent. Um, you know, Lucas dwelt on the ball when then Aaron Machines got injured off on the back of it. Um, I thought Joe Ryan when he came on, to be fair, thought he was good. Um, and the type of player that we know Joe can be. Um, you know, it's just another one that you've got to maybe, um, you know, keep your standards high there all the time. Sometimes he gets a bit of low on confidence and then he has to fight his way back inside and he's a good player for a, 10 games or so, but you know, there's just got too many like that, I think, at the moment. Um, just up and down with their confidence levels and whatever, trying to find a bit of form and, and a bit of confidence and a bit of consistency. Um, but you know, second half, when you know that they're at it a little bit more and mentally switched on a bit more and, and mentally sharp, um, you know, you know what they can do. And follow on from that, it's positive second half and going to a lot of exciting times now. Fourth qualifying round next Saturday, it's half here at Woodside. Plenty to take into today's performance into that one. No, yeah, that's what we've got to do. Um, we've got to start with the, the the fight and the character that we showed. Um, start start the game with that. Um, it's got to be the important thing. But yeah, um, real tough tough tie. Uh, like it's at home, you know, Bath will come wanting themselves to get themselves in the first round. And yeah, um, we're just hoping that um, get officials that. <laughs> know a bit more about about their role and if they see an offside they put their flag up but um yeah what, what can we do we can't we can't control that we can't do nothing about um you know two players being sent off um i don't think he even knew that luca had been booked and you know it's one of them that if you know he's on a booking it's just a late lazy tackle really um shouldn't have made it but i don't think it warranted the yellow card um if we'd done that blimey there'd be 22 bookings went there throughout the game. Um, so, but yeah, all, all that aside, um, you know, it's going to be Aaron's going to be out for a bit now, probably. Uh, Luca and Joe suspended. Um, don't know how long Tutty's going to be out for. Um, Michael Class got a slight tweak on his hamstring. So, all of a sudden, there's there's opportunity for players, and um, you know, them players got to be ready to come and come and take their place. Obviously, quite soon after the moment, but what exactly was it with Aaron that he went down with? Uh, just his knee, I think. Just felt a tweak in his knee when he when he blocked it. Um, I think he blocked it with his right foot, and then the lads come into his his left foot. Um, so yeah, um, probably just gonna need a scan and see the extent of that kind of damage. But yeah, we're all just uh, really hopeful that it's, it's nothing too serious.